the last video I uploaded to my channel I called um, They Are Destroying the Firmament and the Foundations of the Earth. And even though somehow I did a 33-minute video, I forgot to mention the foundations of the earth. Why would a rocket be ruining or, or damaging or do anything to the foundations of the earth? And here's my reasoning why I think that is because of Enoch chapter 18 verses 1 through 5. Enoch says that God furnished the whole creation and the firm foundations of the earth with the four winds. I don't know exactly what that means, but then he says, <clears throat> I saw the cornerstone of the earth. I saw the four winds which bear the earth and the firmament of the heaven. Um, so he, to bear something means to hold it up or to support it, right? To bear the weight of something or to, you know. So it says the four winds bear the firmament and, or the earth and the firmament of heaven. So it's the four winds somehow that are holding everything together. And, and it says they are the foundations of the earth. And then it's then it talk then he says I saw the winds of heaven so he he he's talking about the earth he saw the four winds on the earth but then after that he says I saw the four winds of heaven which turn and bring the sun and the star moon and the stars to their setting so there's winds like people talk about an ether in space or whatever that ether is the four winds, but it's also waters above. Um, I don't know exactly how all this is, but Enoch chapter 18, verses 1 through 5, if you read that and really think about what it says, it's saying that the foundations of the earth are the four winds. Um, and it's, it's actually 18, verse 2 that specifically says that. And verse 1 uh, partially says it, but so uh, Enoch chapter 57, he said that these noisy, these loud uh, flying uh, machines or whatever, these he said chariots or wagons, um, but they were coming on the winds from the east and from the south or whatever. And uh, he said, that the noise of their wagons was heard. And when this turmoil took place, the holy ones from heaven remarked it. And the pillars of the earth were moved from their place. So the four winds. That's why that title is like that. I just wanted to explain that. Read it. Check it out. 18 verses 1 through 5 in the book of Enoch.